Hello guys. I'm gonna teach you how to do some life hacks in Harvest Town. Just for the newbies. So I have 10 here. Number 10, try one tap and stay put only. So once you go to the once you go to your uh, farming site, you have to do a one click only. Don't use don't try to click 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 one click 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 here try just to one click only stay put and uh, it will just automatically harvest the fruits or crops there number nine do the three ad watching routine to get a starter higher card or one hour speed up you should go to your in uh, front of your TV TV television just click your television and uh, uh, click the bonus bonus program for the acceleration card and it has 60 second cooldown. So you cannot wait for the six, 60 second cooldown. Just go to the address book and click the headline today. And once you are done in that ad, it has also a 60 second cooldown. And you don't have to wait for that 60 second cooldown. Go to the event. Go to the event button and uh, click the lucky wheel. Try to uh, spin some wheel, and it also has sixty second cooldown. Once you are done with that, and again, go for the TV and do also some six some ad. Watch some ad, and uh, it also has sixty second cooldown. And uh, that's you have to uh, you can do. Just do some that kind of routine every day. It's it is all uh, also. Uh, if you are lucky, you you can get uh, some good uh, reward in the lucky lucky wheel by spinning some. Uh, also, don't forget to click the daily surprise click the claim because it is free click the claim not the member claim that the claim it was also you can only uh, get that once daily okay next number nine try two way for easy rotation you can just uh, make some two-way road two-way road so you can easily rotate in your manor because some some manor is very rigid and uh, uh, narrow have narrow roads you cannot uh, at least make some movement because it's very hard to rotate here I have two way. You can go there and there easily. For now, you can just do that. But uh, if you have too many production, you can just uh, make some uh, editing. Next number nine. Don't block the fishing spot. In my manor, in the manor, you have at least uh, one, two, three, four. Five, six, seven. At least ten fishing spot. Uh, you can see here that there is a fishing spot here. Do not block the fishing spot here by putting some decorations. There's also a fishing spot here. Don't block the fishing spot here. You can see the fishing spot if at, if it produces bubbles and the fish fishes are jumping. Or hopping next number six don't put fruit trees beside the water area you don't have to put some trees beside the water area uh, you can put the trees but not the fruit trees because once you harvest that fruit when it goes to the water he cannot recover it okay Number five, distribute the chest in one productive area and the remaining at the back of your house. 
since uh, you know the productive area, for example, in this uh, in this farming site, it is a productive area because once you harvest the crops, you're just gonna once you, your bag is full, you're just gonna release that uh, those harvested uh, crops in your chest. So here I have one chest here, so that I will gonna distribute my crops there the harvested one and since uh, the other chests are in are the back are in the back of the of my house i just gonna click the button the blue button at the top you can just uh, go to any of your chest to distribute some some of your items in the bag you can just click for example you have a fish in your bag or some chest in your bag just click the blue button and uh, find the ID chest that is uh, related to your item for example they con it is a container or the same materials you can just uh, drop it there your ancient treasure box next number four buy plenty of goose less chicken because you know when I open this um, my chest for the animal product you can see that I only have six goose you know I have the, the same number of uh, chicken and goose I have eight chicken and eight goose but the but the goose uh, produce some less egg than the chicken so at least try to lessen your chicken and uh, add more goose okay next number three number three use the edit mode in collecting Use the edit mode in collecting. Just click the paint, uh, paint bucket here, the purple bucket, the uh, purple paint bucket, in the left, uh, in the left, in the lower left side. Once you click there, just go to the. Uh, just go to do to the production and click click and click to collect the products okay you can also do that in your poultry or in your barn you can click the x there if you are a collector so that you can uh, you can no longer go there since it's very narrow because of the animals okay you can easily click that it will automatically collect number two plant ginger may for the whole winter you know there are only two crops for the winter and that is ginger may and pure you you can also plant pure but uh, at least less because what we are trying to do is to plant ginger may for all the, for the whole winter you know why because you're gonna sell that harvest of a ginger may and sell it to the stall you can sell it here in the stall because you know you can you have no money you will uh, especially when you have no fish trap or any fishing uh, you have no you can you have not yet unlocked the fishing and the cooking you can know uh, you have no means to earn money so that you have to you have to harvest some ginger may because some um, ginger may is very uh it it is pricey it is pricey especially when you sell them 
you will get a lot of money. When I sell a 999 Jinjun Mei and uh, I full full of Jinjun Mei here in the mobile in the market, at least I got some uh, 80 at least 80,000 gold for that uh, Jinjun Mei when I sold that. Okay. Next is number one. Number one life hack. Use the purple and blue organizer. As you can see in the in your bag, you can see a blue and purple organizer in the uh, lower left part of your bag here and here I don't want to uh, click the purple one because it will just organize the whole bug it will organize the whole bug for example I have a in the number five slot in the number five slot in my bug I have these items these items will uh, it is the gift it is the items that I will give to the NPC so I don't want to disorganize it. Instead, to remain it in that fifth slot. That's why in order to do that, you only have to click the blue. So it will organize itself for each type. If you click the purple button, it will organize it for the whole. It will go to the second or third or fourth but I don't want to do that I want it to remain in the fifth slot that's why I want to organize it so you just use the blue because the purple button it is the whole organize the whole the whole all slot one two three four five so don't do that okay so that's all uh, Stay tuned for more videos, subscribe for more videos, okay? Thank you.